bit of a rough old forest service road. that say and what does my map say my map says I should go right This road would be a heck of an interesting road in the wet weather. I don't think I'd want to do it. GPS says stream on left. Well, maybe that is a stream there in wetter weather. I don't know. The GPS said that there's a stream on my left, and I guess there was. And this looks pretty easy to get across, actually, because it's not too deep in that section. And then a little rocky and steep in the upside, but I shouldn't have any problems with it. However, being the wuss that I am, I may not do it because I'm on my own. It always helps to have a riding buddy with you when you're doing any water crossings I think even though that one's kind of not too big I don't think it's too tricky but I guess I could just hit the wrong super slippery rock and down I go and you never know hurt yourself a bit and need some help getting it the bike up and whatnot that type of thing so i tend to be over cautious in that maybe but it keeps me alive i think if i had a lot more experience you know doing that type of thing with uh with someone with me then i would get a lot more comfortable but I don't have hardly any experience at that sort of thing. And that's why I think it's probably wise to have someone with me. Until I do have that experience. And then I could be able to sort of trust what I'm doing on my own. I mean, when I first started riding off-road, when I bought this bike, that's the first time I've ever ridden off-road. 
I think this route that I have taken today would have been one that I wouldn't have done on my own, you know, too rocky and combined with steepness in places and such, a little tricky. But now that I have had some experience, it's, um, it's no question. I mean, I do this on my own. It's an interesting route. Keeps you on your toes. When it's hilly like this, well, you know, good elevation gain um, and rough, it makes it interesting on an out and back route because going down is pretty much a very different experience than going up. Since I got the um, Acerbis larger tank, it is um, pretty reassuring that I'm not running out of fuel or don't have to be too concerned about that. an interesting little ride. Let's go further though when I'm with a riding buddy across that creek. So listen you people you have a wonderful day eh? and uh, I'll catch you the next time. Ride safe and have fun. <laughs>